assalamu alaikum as you may know there are many different types of fish that live in the ocean one of these fish is called a puffer fish in my video today i'll be sharing some interesting information about puffer fish if you are watching my video for the first time please like comment and subscribe to my channel puffer fish also known as the blow fish is a fascinating and unique species of fish that is found in various parts of the world there are over 120 species of puffer fish and they all share some common characteristics that make them stand out from other fish species in this video we'll explore some interesting information about puffer fish appearance and anatomy puffer fish have a distinct appearance that makes them easily recognizable they have bulbous body with no scales and a small head their skin is tough and rough and they are covered with small spines that make them look like a porcupine puffer fish can inflate their body to several times their normal size by swallowing water which helps them to avoid predators puffer fish have four large teeth that are fused together to form a beak like structure this beak is so strong that it can easily crush the shells of crabs and other hard shell prey puffer fish also have a unique ability to produce a deadly toxin called tetraoxytocin which can be fatal to humans habitat and distributions puffer fish are found in both freshwater and saltwater environments in various parts of the world including the pacific ocean the indian ocean and the atlantic ocean some species of puffer fish can be found in shallow coastal waters while others can be found in deep sea environments puffer fish are often found near coral reefs where they feed on small invertebrates like snails and crabs diet and feeding habits puffer fish are omnivores and have a varied diet that includes both plant and animal matters they feed on algae small invertebrates like snails and crabs and small fish and crustaceans puffer fish have a unique feeding behavior where they use their beak like teeth to crush the shells of their prey some species of puffer fish are also known to use their inflated bodies to trap prey against rocks or other surfaces this behavior is known as puffing and it is an effective way for puffer fish to catch their prey defense mechanisms puffer fish have a number of defense mechanisms that help them to avoid predators their ability to inflate their bodies is one of the most well known defense mechanisms when threatened puffer fish will fill their stomachs with water or air causing their body to expand like a balloon puffer fish also have a deadly toxin called tetraoxytocin which is produced in their skin ovaries and liver This toxin is so potent that it can kill a human within minute of injections. In Japan, puffer fish are considered a delicacy, but only trained and licensed chefs are allowed to prepare them. Reproduction: Puffer fish have a unique reproduction strategy that involves the male fish creating intricate patterns in the sand to attract a female. The male will swim in circles creating a complex pattern that can be several feet in diameter. If a female is attracted to the pattern, she will lay her eggs in the center of the circle and the male will fertilize them. After the eggs hatch, the larvae will float in the water until they are old enough to swim and feed on there. They are listed as critically endangered due to overfishing and habitat loss. Other species like the green puffer fish are not currently considered threatened but their population are being I hope you will enjoy my video Thanks for watching